Yo guys, welcome back to some more Life is Strange. Thank you so much for all the support you guys dropped on the previous videos. Any support y'all drop on this one is much appreciated, like always. Uh, I hope you guys are staying safe out there, wearing your mask like you're supposed to. And yeah, with that being said, let's hop right in. We're in the otter's lair. Big fucking deal. I want that heated water. We still have to play it cool, okay? I still go to school here. You can own this hellhole once you figure out your rewind power. Chloe is so psyched for girls night out, so I better follow her evil plan. Alright, you guys. This is where we left off. Um, If you haven't seen the last part, go watch the last part. Alright. I hope the otters will survive. If only I could solve the mystery of the missing cat picks. Maybe you can. Men's locker room. Alright, uh, we're gonna have to get in there somehow. What's this one? Woman's locker room. Can we get in through there? Nope. I actually don't have the time to investigate this caper. I would love a soda, but I just get wired. All right, uh, let's see. All right, let's talk to her. Boys or girls? Boys or girls? Uh, we didn't really see nothing in the girls' room, so let's go with the boys. Boys, of course. Figures. Perv. Let me check to see if the pool's heated. Alright, ooh, wrong way. I guess somebody forgot their Blackwell spirit. Logan's. I guess I should consider this evolution. Sometimes. Some poor hipster lost their vape. <laughs> Nathan. Oh. It's okay for Nathan to be hooked on these drugs, right? Oh no. Diazepam. I don't know how to say that. Alright, that's for the water. No way am I touching Zach's jersey. Zack is really careless. Doesn't he know what happens when I'm around? Hey, thing in, bad things about you. Cool, what are you wearing? This is my crystal necklace and phone. Hi, what are you wearing? I'm in locker room, only wearing a jersey fit in the football. Bruh. Betty developed that in Jefferson's class. But why? Welcome to 1950. Wow. I bet you do. Max Caulfield, moral avenger, or self-righteous hypocrite. There we go. Let's go. Max, try to find the light for the pool. I want to see the sharks. Otters don't like sharks. They bite. So do I. Hit that light! Alright, uh, where's the, the, uh, light? Is this it? Hold on. There has to be a control panel for the lights around here. <laughs> right there. Alright, before we do that, let's look around. Yes, we get it. Otters.
coffee and swimming. Good combo. So, the big plan is... win. I still think this is a bad idea. Someone might say, Oh, she already got her uh, swimsuit on. Or, she already, uh, she only took her clothes off. That's probably a Time to do or dive, Max. Oh yeah, baby, it feels like a hot tub. Too bad you made me feel like the queen of assholes because I wanted that cash stash. Tell me you're not gonna stand there watching me like a zombie. Don't you dare! Come stop me, hippie! Okay, you asked for it. Cowabunga! Why look, an otter in my water. Dun 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 dun. You are so obvious. And I still get freaked out by that movie, so stop. I can't even watch any of those shark shows. <laughs> I'll just rewind and harpoon you. Otter's revenge. Cheater. Yeah, you wouldn't know about that. <laughs> I wish Rachel was here. She would totally love being in here at night. Wish you guys had met each other. We will. With all this stuff going on, I'm starting to think everything is related. And I want to find out for Kate's sake. She almost died today. Your power is changing everything, Max. Especially you. I can already tell. You're not so chicken shit anymore. Thanks, girlfriend. You know what I mean. You're becoming like... This force of nature. More like luck of nature. Come on, my power failed trying to rescue Kate. Maybe I'm just stumbling back and forth in time. For what reason? You didn't stumble when you saved me, Max. Uh, what if I had thanks to you? Not that time. But that's because you were there to kickstart my power. So it's time to start moving forward in time. And we're obviously connected since without me, you would have never discovered your power, right? Absolutely, I don't know. Yeah, because uh, wasn't the first time she uh, used it was when she saved her life, yeah. Absolutely. You make me feel like I know what I'm doing. And you make me feel like I have a reason for still being in Arcadia Bay. I hope so. Stop being so goddamn humble. You're like the smartest, most talented person I've ever known. More than Rachel Amber? Dude, I'm not her groupie, okay? And I'm sure you have Blackwell bros all over you. Like Warren. Warren is nice. You're the bro killer bros. Warren is... nice. <laughs> nice? Ouch. That means friend zone. No, he's really cool. It was so sweet when he stood up to Nathan. But I haven't told him about my rewind power. No worries. Once you get over yourself, you're gonna make the world bow. As long as you're there with me. Don't look so sad. I'm never leaving you. Now I'm getting cold in here. Because we're yapping instead of attacking each other, Otter versus Shark style. I uh, think I've had my pool experience for the year. Let's check. Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my ass off when I get out. All right, finally. Y'all can't stay here that long, cause someone might come. Gotta be careful. Hurry up, hurry up.
gross. I feel like we just went swimming in Chlorine Bay. You look cute with your hair soaked in chemicals. Thanks. You would know. Hide! Hide. Go, 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 go. See, I knew it. Oh my god. Uh. Dude, oh my god. Move, Max. Don't waste your power on getting busted. Make sure you cover the whole perimeter. You're shitting me? Bruh. Oh my god, that was so close. Dude, hide! Like when we were kids. I could use my power. Or just look for a hiding spot. Or both. Where are they? Oh Hello? God. Right there. I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. Hello? Anybody there? I'm about to break this guy. Better not try code. any Halloween pranks after today. I'm serious. Hurry up and go over there. I heard something over here. Who's here? I got, I got a flashlight and a stick. Oh my, hey! Oh my god. Hurry up, hurry up. Who's here? I got, I got a flashlight and a stick. Gosh. We are so invisible. Let's bail. <laughs> you better hurry up. Bullshit. You can't go back to your dorm now. You're a Blackwell fugitive. Crash at my place tonight. You want me to crash where the Blackwell security officer I just busted lives so I'll be safe? Okay. Into the car! So she did spend the night. Always remember this moment. Photo bomb. Photo hog. It feels like a different world from yesterday. We left a skid mark on Blackwell last night. Like it needs another one. I'd like to do something good for my school in Arcadia Bay. I can't even submit my photo to represent. I just don't want to be rejected. 
Every great artist gets rejected before they get accepted. So you have to enter a photo. Even though I'm pimping the school in town you want to torch? Come on, I don't want to see Arcadia Bay burn to the shore. I just say shit like that because I've been trying to get out of here since... since you left, basically. If I could find Rachel, then pay Frank off. I'm still leaving to start a whole new life. Wish we could just hang out all morning like we used to. Maybe we should get up. I have to get back to Blackwell soon. Oh, does the schoolgirl have a test today? I'm starting to feel like going to Blackwell every day is a test. I just need to get on my regular school schedule again. I know that it is freezing, but I think we have to walk. Alright, let's get up. Keep waving at the taxis, they keep turning. Okay, I need to get dressed now. I love this song. Oh, okay. I can't stop the music. Supplies are endless in the Wait. evening by the hold morning on, on. bell. We can leave? Oh, wait, hold on. We can leave without getting dressed. Put some clothes on first, Hillbilly. Oh, right. I was about to say. Be my own best friend. Ugh. Still reeks like a chlorine factory. See if you can find a suitable outfit in my fashion hole. <laughs> you about to look like Chloe. Wow. I remember this old phone. We decorated it together. The fact that she put the photo next to Rachel is so touching. Okay, time for some Chloe cosplay. Hey, there you go. Rachel left a bunch of her clothes with me. She's your size. But not quite my style. Max, you don't have a style yet. At least give it a try. You can always rewind back to your chlorine brand t-shirt and generic jeans. You suck. <laughs> I like my shirt and jeans. But it would be cool to try on Rachel's clothes just to see if they fit. Stop second-guessing yourself, Max. Put this on and let your inner punk rock girl come out. You can afford to take chances whenever and whatever you want to try. For example, I dare you to kiss me. What? I double dare you. Kiss me now. Bruh. What? <laughs> oh my god. Well, uh... Even if we uh, choose this one, <laughs> we can just go back and change our uh, 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 choice. So let's see what will happen. Damn, you're hardcore, Max. Now I can text Warren and tell him he doesn't stand a chance, unless he's into girl and girl action. You're such a dork. Oh man, that was priceless when I kissed Chloe. She didn't think I would. Alright, now let's go back. Beautiful oh. outfit in my fashion. Sure okay. Sorry, not that easy. Oh, like I am? Just admit that you already macked on me, then used your rewind. Now I can text Warren that you're saving yourself all for him. <laughs> I am so going to best unfriend you for that. Wow. I love that Chloe is so fearless. Looking sick, Max. A couple tats, some piercings, and we'll make a thrasher out of you yet. Ready for the mosh pit, Shaka Bra? Oh, no. Maybe not. Stop. Go on Stop. down and say Stop. hi to Joyce. Free breakfast? I have to uh, wake and bake first. I promise not to tell. Let's not rewind and find out, okay?
don't look too bad. Alright, what's my error? Oh, at least we haven't been identified. Yet. Thank God she's okay. I wonder when I can visit her. Yeah, um, I, I, I was about to say something about that. When can we visit Kate? Haven't seen her in a while. Alright, let's go. Oh my god, that smells so amazing. It's like when we were kids here. Alright, what'd she say? Max, thank you from my heart for reaching out to me on the roof. You're the only one who was there for me at school, the only one who truly cared. I have to believe you were sent to give me hope. You did so much more than that. My father is grateful as well. You'll, you'll always be in our prayers, love, and blessings. Your friend, Kate. No problem, Kate. Hey, Kate, I'm so glad you're okay. I will visit you soon as I can, I promise. All right. Good morning, Joyce. Rachel! Uh, I, I mean, Max. Oh, you startled me. Well, you fit those clothes well. Thank God you're not a hellraiser like her or Chloe. Now tell me exactly what you want to chow on. Pancakes, eggs, and bacon. Uh, let's go with the pancakes. I'm dying for some of your famous pancakes. I thought you would have missed those. Ah, you ate more than William, and he loved them. <laughs> I remember. We would erase each other to grab them from the stack. So this time, you can help me with the ingredients. I need you to grab me the eggs and milk. Eggs and milk? No problem. Alrighty. Oh, the eggs right here. The eggs always come first, as Joyce used to say. <laughs> Alright, now for the milk. I love that they still have the same oh, refrigerator. It's not in there. Oh, here we go. Now for the mother's milk. Uh, hold on. Who drinks beer this early around here? <laughs> you, you know who. Freaking David. Oh, man. I don't want to be famous for this. Thanks. After all these years and everything that's happened, it's great to see you and Chloe together again. She hasn't had a good friend since you or Rachel. Oh, those clothes remind me so much of her. Such a sweet girl. I'm just hoping she's living large in LA. I'd love to think that too, Joyce, but... We are on the same page, Max. I keep hoping that Rachel will show up or even send a message to Chloe from Hollywood. Or wherever she is. Is Rachel okay? Rachel in trouble? Was Rachel mad at Chloe? Is there any reason that Rachel might be mad at Chloe and left without her? Chloe could piss everybody off but her. They were almost joined at the head. Reminded me of you and Chloe. Rachel wasn't as grounded as you. I'm grounded? Since when? Maybe that's why Chloe likes Rachel so much. <laughs> Max Caulfield, are you actually jealous of Rachel? No way. Maybe. Maybe. Rachel was so much cooler than me. <laughs> you think? Then why has Chloe been telling me she wishes she could be more like you over the past five years? Doubt it. Um, did she really? Five years ago feels like a thousand now. And that makes me what, a century old? <laughs> You're only 18, Max. Oh, you. If only I could go back. It's not all that, Joyce. Voila, a breakfast fit for us queens. And a king. <laughs> go sit at the table. David's not so much of a king. Uh, open. I keep expecting to see the sky turn red. Hmm. 
It's time to grub in. Let's go. Fresh pancake. Thank you so much, Joyce. I'm never leaving this table. Good, you can clean. I'm glad that's creamy and not crunchy. All right. Now that's what I call pancakes. Facts. Let's dig in. I guess nobody waters the plant here. Okay. Oh man, I don't want to be famous for this. Seeing you again, ah, oh, made me remember so much. I know these photos don't measure up to your work, Max. My favorite photographers probably take pictures similar to yours. You make David happy, Joyce. He wants us all to be happy, Max. He's just not great at showing it. Can I say that again? Uh, I don't think I can rock this outfit like Rachel. You have your own cool style. Wow, sir. I totally remember that day. I'm glad. William took this picture with his instant camera. <laughs> oh, it was the last picture he ever took. He had his car out right after this. And, and... I know, Joyce. I'm sorry. Damn. I didn't show you this to be morbid. In fact, I want you to have this. This was when my baby was so full of life and light. She was hopeful, positive, and everything she's not today. And this was the last time I ever saw Chloe truly happy. Did you guys have a bonding session about how fucked up I am? It's not always about you. Chloe, please, it's too early to start picking a fight. Eat instead. I'll keep the warden busy while you go peek in the garage. Now stop whispering, or I'll know you're talking about me. Stop being so nosy, Mother. Jeez, I can't do anything around here without everybody getting up in my shit. Uh, no one can even joke with you, Chloe. You fly off the handle like that. Excuse me, I have to use the bathroom. Sure, run off and pee when you should back me up. Now, who's being paranoid? Just listen to yourself. Nobody else does. I do need to get into David's computer. He's gotta be hiding shit. All right, let's see, what do you got? No shit, it needs a password. How about step douche? Try again. I need more clues. All right, let's look in here. Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. Thing to see here. Alrighty. Padlock. Naturally, David would buy a heavy duty military padlock. I can even see the combination. That might be a useful password. Seven, one, seven, one. Worst hacker ever. Uh, Such so wrong. No, no, no. Uh, go back, go back.
Chloe can't get another gun now. Unless she steals it back from Frank. Looks like David has read this a lot. What did he learn? I could try the license number for the password. Huh. Maybe this ID number might work. Even David Madsen might be an angel to somebody else. Now the car looks ready to roll. This is a better hobby for David than surveillance. Hold on. Let me look at this. Oh, wait. I can search. Joyce might as well have wrote, let's get married. That might be a useful password. Alrighty. That's cute. Could be a password here. Still need to find the password to David's computer. Okay. Obviously, David's parents care about him. That date might be a good password. Let's see. Try again. Score! Let's Max go. the hacker strikes again. Whoa, spoiler alert. Rachel definitely hooked up with Frank. But why does David care? Wow, he didn't even show this to his daughter. Well, it's not really his daughter. Stepdad, so. Dang. Rachel avoids her, her dorm, follow Rachel to the lighthouse. Instead of stalking Kate, David could have helped her. Mm, that's messed up. Tried to talk to Kate about the party. She got upset and ran guilty. This is so wrong. Oh, creepy bastard. I better tell Chloe about this now. It's just one more thing to make her sad and mad. Nice breakfast. David, you, you back already? That's what happens when you lose your job as head of Blackwell Security. What happened? What you would expect to happen in this PC college bullshit age. The principal takes the words of lying stone students over a veteran and law professional. Uh, again? This isn't the first time you've gotten in trouble there. Well, now it's the last time. I'll get a lawyer to sue their ass. Figures you'd be here. Is that your Rachel Amber Halloween costume? You know more about her than me. No, you and Chloe think you know more than anybody, like all teenagers. Leave Max alone, David. Oh, I can't believe you got fired. No, of course I can believe you got fired. Did you threaten some poor student with a stockade? He threatens them with surveillance cameras so he can spy on everybody, like he spies on all of us here. Don't start, Chloe. Not now. Yeah, I'm just always starting shit, right? You're a total paranoid, Dave. Oh. Not now, Chloe. 
You used to call me a loser for getting kicked out of Blackwell. So who's say. the loser now, David? Who haven't you accused or harassed? Between your investigations into Rachel and Kate, what have you done besides get in trouble? Ooh. Side with David, side with Chloe. Let's uh, side with David to, to, to um, see what happened. Listen, we don't know that David did anything, and nobody has any proof against him. <laughs> yes, we do. As far as we know, it's Nathan Prescott who's the real threat so far. I would cut David slack here. Oh, would you? How generous, King Max. So suddenly it doesn't matter how shady David has been acting, or that he keeps all those weird files on your classmates, or how you're always going off on how creepy David Enough. is. Enough! I don't want anybody being accused of anything. There's been too much of that crap going on around here lately, and I don't want it in my home today. Well, I agree with that. Now, if you all don't mind, I'd like to forget about work and sit down and eat some of this incredible grub. I have to take a dump. Are you coming, Max? Wow. Maybe I went too easy on David for Joyce's sake. All right. Let's see what's going to happen if we side with Chloe. David, I saw you harass Kate Marsh when she was going through hell. You could have totally helped her. Everybody at Blackwell is a suspect to you, except for Nathan Prescott. That's why the students and faculty don't like you. You even threatened me. I do respect your service, but you don't respect anybody. Uh, you were smoking pot in Chloe's room. That's illegal. So is spying on people in your family and at your work. Why do you have photos of Kate Marsh and Rachel Amber in your files anyway? What? Is this true, Max? Yes, David. Why do you have these files at all? I find this very disturbing. I do not have to take this kind of interrogation. Not from you punks. Maybe you should calm down. Oh, you're turning on me now, huh? Of course. Women always stick together. Well, screw you. Wow. David! You better go to a hotel until we figure this out. You can't kick me out of my own home. It's my home, David. Paid for and in my name. You Ooh. know the law, right? Damn. Oh, I, I thought I knew a lot of things. Like when I'm out flanked. Have a nice day. Chloe, for once, just please shut up. I hope Joyce doesn't hate me for tearing into David. No, because uh, we told the truth, and th th that shouldn't hurt nobody. And um, plus, he shouldn't have all those students' uh, files and stuff. Let's speak to her now. Max, don't beat yourself up. David earned this all by himself. Understand? See? She, she understands. I don't want to see or hear you again, Max. You've hurt me and my family enough. She didn't. That's all on you, mister. Max, that gave me chills. And you better not rewind this one. Oh, shut up. Listen, when I went through David's laptop, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank being more than friends. <laughs> right, no way, Max. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not gonna believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? What's that gonna prove? Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? Motherfucker better not have anything. For his sake. Let's check the door. Frank gets so wasted, he sometimes forgets to lock it. I 
can't believe you hung out with him. Not anymore. We have to be casual ninjas here. Shitballs. Okay, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then you come in and rewind so Frank doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key, and, uh, and... <laughs> you don't know. Chloe, let me I got this. this. Yeah. I'll be right back. Don't let my epic plan get in the way of yours. I'll try to scrounge up a Scooby snack to distract his mangy mutt. Scooby snack. Now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. Alright, uh, we can't go through there because of the dog. This is so creepy. Alright. Uh, uh Maxine Popier, I'm sorry I, I haven't gotten in touch sooner. I know your mom is very proud of you for saving that girl. A as am I, we have have no doubt that East to Blackwell was the best thing you ever demanded we do. It makes us so proud to read. <coughs> Excuse me. So proud to read about you in the news and see actual video of you walking down from the roof with that girl. If you want to come back home now to relax and maybe go to a high school around here, the door is wide open. Love pop. Thanks, pop. It's been a whirlwind here. I'm not ready to come home yet. Talk later. All right. type of food for the dog or something. What is going on here? Dang, all these dead uh, birds. Okay. Uh, uh, Alright, you guys. Um, I, I, I am going to, t to stop the video here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, um... Oh my god, shut up, oh, hey. <laughs> uh, uh, Alright you guys, um, I I I I if you uh, want to see what happens next, make sure to leave a like on the video. Um, I I if you're new to my channel, subscribe and make sure you have the bell n n n n n n notification turned on on my channel so you don't miss when I post a video. And so that you can be the first one to watch my video and leave a like on it. It, it really helps out my channel. And yeah, um, stay safe out there, wear your mask like you're supposed to, and I I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, my brothers and my sisters.